Hello guys, here is uh, Roberto Colombo and uh, okay, first I apologize for my English accent which is uh, a kind of mix of Italian and English being Italian but I hope it will be anyway understandable for you so this is my first tutorial and uh, I'm happy to show you a technique that uh, can make life easier for the terrible problem that everybody knows of the alignment of uh, animation clips when uh, uh, a clip uh, animation clip is applied after a previous one and the avatar the character is as a completely different orientation so maybe the avatar ended up in the right direction in the right direction then uh, we apply new clips and then it start in the left direction so how to do we have a different technique already shown by other people in uh, the re reallusion uh, community which are still valid and but i i was never satisfied uh, with them with all the respect for the people who discovered them which are absolutely great uh, help so far but what uh, didn't satisfy me is that uh, they are based on how to modify the next clip in order to align to the previous one while in this uh, video that i show you i will show you what is the problem uh, due to the previous clip the original one and i try to fix this one so the next clip will smoothly apply so i talk enough and uh, let's go just uh, one snap of the finger to uh, synchronize the video because i'm uh, first took the video and then i'm adding the voice one two three tack. Okay, first uh, I put Chuck in here and uh, let's see what's happened when I apply uh, animation. This is our animation very, very generally offered by Rampa, one of the user of Iclone, a great uh, uh, developer of tutorial. He converted a lot of, okay, don't do this, I do every time, I don't select Chuck. He converted a lot of BVH animation and offer for the community okay this is the running running to your left easy the cut and move and to your left now after this i want to apply a walk i take the standard walk clip that is a camera with a chuck so i apply the walk and what happened Puck. chuck change the direction and uh, okay we know why <laughs> this is a problem that many people experience and personally i try to develop all the possible uh, solution that cost a lot of time so i now today i decided to try something to find a way to so i reset everything and i will show you how i did take off everything so the first thing is uh, i try to understand what is the reason of this uh, change so i created a little helper called a pointer okay the pointer and uh, let's zoom in a bit is just a pointer it's showing the direction and I want to show what is the direction of the internal uh, bone root of Chuck when he's moving because this is the source of all the problems so I link the pointer to Chuck and notice I link to the bone uh, root and I link uh, I follow position and rotation so now again I apply the same animation again uh, provided by ramp okay here it is Okay, and same mistake as usual, I now select the avatar and now look at what happened let's zoom in a bit you see the pointer, where his point is not pointing in the direction where Chuck is running let's follow it again slowly zoom a bit, the little line Tuck. you see Chuck turn left, the pointer doesn't turn, means the bone, the bone root is not following the Chuck direction and this is the problem, this is the, what I we have to fix. I don't have so much idea to fix the next animation click, I want to fix this one. I want that chuck and the animation with the ball root pointing to the direction of the avatar. So to do. So first uh, I go somewhere a bit before the end of the clip and I created two keyframes, one for the transform key and one for the animation layer key. Then I move one frame later and uh, I edit the chuck, I rotate Chuck 90 degrees. You see now the the pointer is pointing the other direction, but Chuck is rotated, of course, because I am rotating him. So how to do it? The only thing I have to do is to rotate the Chuck back. Open the edit mode motion later layer. Remove all the constraint from every joint. Now point to the waist. 
for Code Lower Tours in uh, previous and rotate chart. Now you can look a bit on the timeline if you are satisfied. You see the legs are a bit uh, different, so you can slightly adjust. That's uh, pretty much easy. Move a bit. Uh, Okay, here is a big mistake as usual, again click the right frame, so let's do it again. Okay, a bit aligned. Tuck. Okay, slight moving, but I'm kind of satisfied, then you can of course spend a little more time to make it better. And now that's it. Now not so much to do. Let's uh, add the walk. The walk is okay. We can play all together again. See? And it's quite smooth. And this is the, the, the way I think uh, it's, uh, we can do when we have the problem of the uh, orientation. I hope you enjoy and uh, I hope this will be helpful for everybody. I will keep on adding additional tutorial. This is my first one. And uh, okay, you can, uh, <laughs> you can criticize if you like or say it's uh, useful. And uh, I hope uh, you will find it uh, a way to speed up your editing of the animation. Cheers!